I collect all members of TXT and these are the different materials that I use. So I use the Comics 2 inch D-ring binder, Ultra Pro and BCW pocket pages, and Ultra Pro deck protector sleeves for my photo arts. I'll link everything I use in the description box below so in case any of you are interested you can check out the links there. So I buy majority of my photo cards through Shopee or through people on Twitter. You can check my first photo card collection video. I'll link it below about more information on how to find people selling certain photo cards and other places where you can find different sellers too. Hello friends, so this is my binder. I used to have my TXT photo cards in a bigger binder along with my other photo cards of other groups but Back when I filmed my first photo card collection video, they only had photo cards for the Dream Chapter Star, which is why it was alright to keep them there because it was only about 10 cards. But since it's been 2 years since that video, their collection has obviously grown a lot and I decided to put them in their own binder. So this is a 2 inch D-ring binder, which I probably have to change for a bigger one since it's getting quite full already but anyway so in the front i just have this cover i used the blue r stickers to decorate it and a few ribbon and flower stickers that i own i did this at like 3 a.m the other day by the way because i was so bored and i thought my binder was too plain so yeah this is the cover i just put it on this sheet of paper so the back just has all the cup sleeves that i have from different cup sleeve events i wish i had cup sleeves for all the members though but since you know covid happened cup sleeve events are literally non-existent over here which makes me really sad but hopefully in the future i get to add more to this collection anyway let's get started with the video so when we open it up we have my stickers here that i used to decorate the cover with and then this is the pre-order gift for the 2021 season's greetings it's the pop-up standy thing and then here where all the photo cards are i don't have any dividers for my photo cards because i'm just too lazy to make but they're arranged in the order of release so obviously we start with the debut album the dream chapter star this was the only set that is a part of my first photo card collection video because it was the only release that they had during that time these are the two group cards one is from my signed album and the other one is from my normal copy and then these are yonjun's photo cards i put him here because he's my bias anyway but he like won't fit in the page where all the rest of the members are so i just decided to separate him and that's how i did it for the rest of the cards where only four members would be able to fit he was so small and young i can't so over here we have the rest of the members, Subin, Bomgyu, Taeyeon, and Hyuninkai, they're arranged by age. Yup. And the thing is, short story time, in case you didn't see my first photo hard collection video, I had no intentions of collecting all the members, but I already had 3 out of 5. So I said, you know what, I'm gonna collect Bomgyu and Yeonjun anyway, might as well get everyone's cards because I pulled everyone but the two of them. At first I was originally collecting OD5 for this set and then just Yeonjun for the rest of the albums, but obviously that didn't happen and here we are collecting ot5 for the next three albums which is doing okay for now but we'll see in the future behind it i just keep the stickers that come with the album because i don't know it has their faces anyway might as well keep them here next we start with the dream chapter magic again i put yonjun's here because he's my bias and then we have the id cards for the sanctuary and arcadia version the id pad thing and the tu photo card next page we have the id pads for the rest of the members it's also arranged by age order i know some people they don't like putting this in their binders because it's a little too thick and bulky but i just put them there because it looks cute <laughs> maybe in the future if it gets too full i'll probably remove them but for now they're okay there we have the tu photo cards and i really like these photo cards because the little graphics are so cute and i really like the colors love it love it it's so cute and then over here we have the rest of the members id cards i really like how it looks because it's so i don't know it just looks so satisfying to see the cards laid out like this so now we're moving on to the dream chapter eternity 
these are the TU photo cards. It kind of annoys me that there's nothing here, but yeah, I arranged it by age order this way. So Yeonjun, Subin, Bonggyu, Taeyeon, and Yuningkai. It. So the dream chapter eternity is the birth of semi selfie TXT album photo cards because in their past two albums they never did photo cards that were selfie cards. And this is the birth of half a selfie, which is still character development, you know, we appreciate the growth. It took me quite a while to finish this set because of this Subin port photo card. Oh my god. Every single day, I would wake up and say, I wish I find a Subin port photo card today. <laughs> like, whenever I would see these things, it's either someone already got it before me or it's just sold out. I just remember when I found the listing for this, I literally prayed before opening the listing that it wasn't sold already. I just felt so happy when I finally found this because this was the last card that I needed to complete the entire set for this album. And then next set is the starboard version. I remember being so happy because I pulled Yeonjun's photo card from my album and I pulled also his TU photo card and that was like the first time I ever got a Yeonjun set in my album. I really like this set too because they look so soft. On the next page, I just have the postcards. I remember when everyone saying, oh my god, Alice in Wonderland concept and we didn't get an Alice in Wonderland concept. Then here are the stickers. And then these are the postcards that came with the pre-order benefit, like the pouch thing from Weavers. So now we're moving on to Blue R era, which is my favorite era. Don't get me wrong, I love Runaway. Before anyone attacks me, I love Runaway, but Blue R is my dream, like TXD concept, because I really love songs that sound like Blue R. So I was so happy about this. And also, can I just say, I didn't know that this photo card was like rare. Like a lot of people want it and apparently it's really hard to pull. So I guess I'm just lucky because I pulled it from my extra album. Thank you King for blessing me with your photo card because I see this card go for like 500 pesos and that's not okay. Like why are you, why are you pricing the cards like that besties? And it's not even out of print. But yeah, here are the photo cards of Yeonjun, Subin, and Bamgyu. And then here are Taeyeon's and Hyunin guys. And I love this photo card. I just really love this photo card of Taeyeon. Come on, King. But anyway. Also, I love this one of guys. I don't know. I just really love the cards for this album. And this is also the first era that they did selfie cards like this. So everything about Blue R. Perfect. And then from here, we have the postcards, which I also collected. And I put them here, even though they make my binder a little too thick. I'm just gonna speed through it because it's quite a lot. Okay, so we're done with the postcards. Here are the stickers. So I just put them back to back. And then these are the stickers that came as a pre-order benefit. Like if you ordered one copy from Reverse, you get a random photo card and a sticker set. The photo card I got actually was Bomb Goose, but I found someone who wanted to trade. And then this page gonna be like the random dump page of pre-order stuff or lucky draw photo cards and all. I have the Eternity, Lucky Draw, and the Blue R pre-order benefit. So let me just show you this card. It's like plastic, so it's really sturdy. But yeah, just wanted to show it to you guys. Anyway, so those are all the album cards. And then over here, we start with the Japanese releases. So this is Magic R. They didn't have photo cards included in the albums for Magic R, but they did have pre-order benefits and at the time when Magic R was released, I didn't know how to buy from Japanese websites because I've never bought Japanese albums for any other group ever. So I just bought through waivers and these were the pre-order cards that I have. Next page, we have the photo cards for drama. These are also from Weaver Shop. So, yep, we have all five of the members. And then I also learned how to order from Japanese sites now. I got the postcard set from Universal Music Store. But what annoys me is that Yuninkai is alone. I wish I could like 
put him here in the middle but come on flawless king we have still dreaming this is where they started to do random member photo cards in the album and there are like four sets of photo cards but clearly i can't collect all of them because japanese cards are already expensive to begin with i just decided to collect the standard version for this album because it's the easiest ones to find and it's the cheapest ones too but i decided to collect all of yonjun's for the rest this is my favorite set out of all the sets of this release and also of all their japanese cards over here we have a postcard from one of the still dreaming albums i'm not sure if it was from universal music store but if not then it's from hmv so it looks like over here we have the 2020 season's greetings photo cards and this was the actual birth of txt selfie cards this card i pulled this from my season's greetings and i didn't realize how people wanted this so bad that people are selling this for so much money like way too much money and for what reason yeah i'm just really happy to have this in my collection next we have the 2021 selfie photo cards. So I love this photo card so bad that I got an extra one in this My Melody keychain. And I also love this photo card of Taeyeon. Next page, we have the fairy profile cards. I originally got Huning Kai's from my season's greetings, but I traded with my friend. So thanks, Matt, for feeding my deranged ass. I have two because I forgot that I pre-ordered this in November because someone was selling the inclusions of the season's greetings separately and I bought the standee and this fairy profile card and for the standee I got Bombu in mine and then I just bought Yeonjun's and then here are the fan live photo cards i have two sets i got different versions for both of the sets except for yonjun's like i got two of these so i just sold the other one and then i found someone selling this one then for the unit photo cards the ones that i pulled were both sukai's and then i just got the rest i got these versions for the other three but yeah i'm really happy with these cards and then over here we have the mini bag photo cards i don't know why big hit likes to make the sizes of their merch photo cards for like concert stuff this big like why i just want to know anyway moving on we have this profile card thing and if you pre-ordered fan live merch you get a random member and originally i got subins which is right here at the back but I saw someone sell Yeonjun's for a really cheap price. So I decided to get it too. And then over here we have the New Year's Eve live postcards. So I have all the members. And it annoys me that Bomb Use is horizontal. <laughs> but what can we do? Yeah, this will have to do. And do you see how cute they are? It looks like a family photo. I love it. TXT light stick photo card. Yeah, these are cute cards too. Bomgyu is so cute with this beret and Taeyeon too. I don't know if it's pronounced as R or HR, but I'm just gonna call it R. So these are the R postcards that you get. So you get one for each member. And I really like how this turned out because Taeyeon's is horizontal and I'm able to put it there. He is so cute and so small. Here are the r bookmarks for r and r2 the mini poster from the r2 photo book now this page is where i'm gonna put all my dvd and photo book cards so as of now i only have this which i was lucky enough to pull in my copy of r i also see people pricing this for way too much i just want to know guys why we need to overprice pieces of paper but anyway yeah that's what i got from my photo book and that's it that's the last of it so let me close this up that's it for my photo card collection video yeah i'm really happy to see how much my collection has grown since my first photo card collection video and i hope you had fun seeing the progress too and i'll see you guys in my next video bye